Sorry for the delay, everybody. Oh, here we go. How we doing? Wonderful win for Jackson State. Wonderful win. W.C. Gordon. Uh, classic. I think we're 2 0 within that since I've been here. Up under uh, A.D. Ashley uh, Robinson. I'm excited. I'm excited about uh, what we got going. But I'm not satisfied. And you're going to understand that. What is that? Is that normal? Sounds like we're in a darn spaceship or something, man. Y'all can hear that? Mm hmm. Y'all just, it's just cool with y'all. <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't, I don't accept me at Arkansas, man, for no reason. Let's go. Coach, kind of walk us through that last drive there. Which one? When we had the ball or they had the ball? When they had the ball going in. Uh, um, time first of all, the game should never got to that point. Defense played lights out, then they got a little complacent in the second half. I forewarned them at halftime that this is what I felt in the locker room. And we went out there and ensued just what we just talked about in the locker room. It shouldn't happen. Got a little complacent. Offense has been stagnant ever since uh, Moby Dick was a middle. And uh, thank God the defense made the plays that they should have made. We had some heck of a calls. I hear them uh, conversating over the headset, and they're really good and, and uh, astute at what they do. And they have a commitment to excellence, and they're playing their butts off. I mean, uh, we knew what they were going to do, what they were going to try to do, and the defense played their butts off. They got the job done. Going into the bye week, what will be your evaluation? Um, get guys healthy, number one. Make sure they catch up on their academics, number two. Make sure they catch up on their academics, number three. Make sure they catch up on their academics, number four. And uh, try to develop some of the younger guys. Give them a little more time because some of the older guys may be a little banged up. Lean off of them a little bit. Let some of the younger guys develop and see if they could uh, contribute from special teams. Start the entry point in special teams. That's the starting point. And again, see if they can contribute furthermore. But that's uh, our thought process going into the bye week. Your thoughts uh, on that Delta State uh, football team? Delta State played hard. They played tough, uh, disciplined. We threw a lot at them early. Uh, we tried to knock them out. I mean, and they wouldn't fold. They wouldn't fold. They wouldn't quit. They wouldn't stop. They kept going and going and until they hit a couple big plays and then they got momentum going. My hat's off to the whole coaching staff there and the program that they have. What is it about the offense? I know there were five sacks. Is it the pressure, uh, the offensive line? Is that the a little bit of everything? A little bit of everything. It, everything that you see, I see. That's what that's what is about the offense. Despite that, Shadur still putting up numbers. He's having great. Yeah, but it, 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 it shouldn't be riding on a freshman and uh, uh, the consistency of a freshman. It should. It, it, we should be much better than what we are right now. And I think we know that. I think you guys know that. And I, I know you're thinking that, man, what if? I don't like what if game. I like let's do it. I don't like that what if game because then I start thinking about the real what ifs. What if there ain't nobody here? <laughs> <laughs>